So good afternoon my dear students, uh, how are you? And I hope uh, you are fine by the grace of Almighty Allah. You are staying at home and remaining safe. And here uh, I'm Ikem Rejol Karim, Senior English Teacher of BF Shine College Dhaka is with you uh, on this online class. And you all are most welcome to this English class. Okay, uh, in the last two classes we completed uh, uh, our uh, syllabus of uh, voice chance. And this is a very important grammatical topic that you have to have a clear conception, clear knowledge about the rules of virgins and especially some of the exceptional rules we have learned about that. So today uh, we are just going to have the test on virgins. Your test will be divided into two uh, parts and the first one I will give you some easiest examples so that you can solve it, uh, uh, solve it so swift, so fast and then i will go for uh, the second test that is somehow a bit harder okay i don't think uh, it will be harder for you because if you gone through uh, all the rules uh, of watches i think you will probably uh, write the correct answer okay so uh, i i'm hopeful about that about you are doing excellent in that exam so you are perhaps you are ready for the test i i i'm seeing a lot of a uh, lot of you are participating here uh, in this class and uh, and I also think that you have prepared yourself very well so that you can get the highest marks or the full marks in this test. So this is your question and you just write down the answer. Okay. And if you cannot see it properly, I will make it full screen. Just you, perhaps you, you have started writing the answer. Please write down the answer. Be careful about the silly mistakes that you can make. Okay, uh, because uh, in grammar there is no chance. There is no chance to be rewarded if you if you uh, make many uh, make any kind of mistakes. How silly it may be. Okay, mistake is always uh, is always taken as a mistake in grammar because whenever you are writing a passage, paragraph, or you are writing a composition, that it may uh, your your mistakes may be may be considered maybe uh, uh, maybe. Uh, uh, may be excused but uh, of course whenever you are going through the grammar there is no mistake that should not be uh, taken in consideration okay so be careful about the mistakes silly mistakes if you have just completed your writing the answer then you must write down yes sir or done completed like these words you can write in the comment so that I can understand that you have uh, completed writing the answer. Really wonderful that you have completed writing all the answers and most of you have written all done everything is finished my test is over and so on okay. I'm really so pleased that you have uh, written all the answers and that's really wonderful. Okay, first one, Ishik, uh, you have written down that uh, online English class is going to be attended by us. That's the correct answer. Online English class is going to be attended by us. That's in Rubaid Lihachwa. Taiba Lihachwa, online English class is going to be attended by us. That's wonderful. Right, Raki Brinath online English class is going to be attended by us. That's really right answer, absolutely, because you know that is is going to that is a model auxiliary verb, and you know after model auxiliary verb you will have to use be and past participle form of the verb to make it passive. Yes, absolutely, everyone's answer is correct. That's really write down answer number two. We should follow the rules of cleanliness. So write down answer number Sirhan Likacho, Bonni Likacho. Navila Lihacho, Aki Vaidid Lihacho, Ismam Lihacho, right? Raki Brina, Taiba, Tapure, Rubayat, Ishik, and everyone. That's wonderful. Your answer is correct. Then uh, you will go for uh, uh, Fatih in online English class is going to be attended by us. The rules of Taiba Lihacho, the rules of cleanliness should be followed by us. That's really was the easiest one. We should follow the rules of cleanliness. Yes, the, your answer is correct. The rules of cleanliness should be followed by us. The rules of cleanliness should be followed by us. That's really good. Uh, wonderful. Right answer. The rules of cleanliness should be followed by us. Wow. 
that means you have done it properly excellent uh, right i'm really very impressed to see all the answers everyone is correct everyone is doing excellent that's really good uh, but actually i want to see all of your answers so probably you will try to write down the answer those who are watching on tv perhaps they will not be able to write down the answer but those who are watching it uh, watch, watch, watching the class in a mobile phone or uh, yeah using your computer they can just write down the answer very uh, right absolutely right then you go for answer number three aki why did question write down the answer number three i was made to wash my hand by him that's really wonderful yes absolutely your answer is correct absolutely my hand was made to be washed uh, ishik i'm sorry baba you you are mistaken because you can lock for he made me wash my hand this was the rule of bare infinitive and you see there you have to use uh, subject is he made verb me hote object so you have to bring me first tahole me ta ke prothome niye gelo i hobe i and made be to that means i was made and wash this is a bare infinitive you have to use the infinitive form to that means i was made to wash my hand by him othoba by him my yeah, my hand by him that's good tahole eta answer ta hobe i was made to wash my hand by him i was made to wash my hand by him atikul i was made to wash my hand by him rinad i was made to wash by me. all right uh, all right ha siran likhecho nabil likhecho rubai likhecho absolutely good chudi shik tomar uttor de thik kore na baba then number 4 <coughs> father is cooking a special dish for us father is cooking a special dish for us special dish is being cooked for us by father also you can write down a special dish is being cooked uh, for us by father for us uh, by father or special dish is being cooked by father for us that is also right mm, that is also right okay you can also write down that uh, uh, you can also write down that uh, if uh, a special dish is being cooked uh, for us by father okay we must listen to our elders uh, you just write down the answer number five uh, okay wow really i'm so pleased at my heart that that you have done so well actually uh, really i'm so pleased rakib rinat please uh, i did your answer is absolutely right our elders must be listened to by us but rakib rinat be careful about you have missed one word that is our elders must be listened to what is two if you do not use two your answer will be mistaken your answer will be wrong uh, you have to write down the answer uh, of course listen to rakib rinat be careful about the word and write down the word two after listened okay a uh, special dish is being cooked for us by him our elders must be listened to by us that's right our class must be listened to our class our class can over our elders uh, ishik our elders must be listened to by us tara hura korar kichu nei aste dhire likho aste dhire likho so be slow in writing the answer so don't make it so hurry okay tar hora kora kichu nei late than never okay late is better than never mane na lekhar theke obosshoi deri kore right answer ta lekha ta better so you just uh, right uh, to hobe rakib thik kore chora rakib rakib nat okay right Arifa uh, Likacho, our elders must be listened to by us. Taiva Likacho, wow, wow, that's great. Uh, excellent. Shabaruto, right to it. And we will go for our last, uh, number six, the most important sentence perhaps now at this moment. We can prevent coronavirus staying at home. So, coronavirus can be prevented staying at home by us. Raki Brunad Likacho, Strat Likacho, coronavirus can be prevented if we stay at home. Baba, if we stay, uh, they are provision key 
खुब सुंदर लिखे That is good, uh, wonderful, wonderfully right answer. Wow, Ij, this is your innovations. Sometimes the answer that I did never think in my brain, you can create that answer. That's really wonderful. That this is your innovation, and this is why you are better than I. Okay, uh, and one thing I must say, if your students <coughs> uh, do not know more than you, then he or she is not a good student at all. So of course you are better than I. Coronavirus can be prevented staying at home by us. Excellent. Your answer is absolutely right. So I am uh, going to your full answer there. So you see, you just match your answers. Uh, there you see the answers. So you match all your answers together, and you see, uh, you uh, just give. You are now the examiner as well as your examiner. Uh, so you just simply write down uh, you, you just you just see how uh, many you have made correct that's why you give marks you give marks so to me marks thou and i want to see the yeah, tumra who has got 6 out of 6 uh, or 5 out of 6 okay 4 out of 6 if you can just write down uh, how uh, many you have made correct Uh, it's really this is the good thing i am really feeling pleasure at my heart that uh, you uh, are enjoying uh, this classes very much and actually uh, i feel so good at heart that i am also very pleased to uh, take this classes online classes first time actually i was very afraid yeah, how much it should be interactive uh, between the teacher and the students however i am here sitting in a room and you are uh, there uh, in your house so how can we con uh, conduct the class like that so i really appreciate all of your participation and you are doing uh, fine and this is really the thing i want from my heart okay i really salute you i really appreciate you for all of these things okay so let's uh, go to the next test perhaps you are again ready with your pen and paper so we are going for the test again uh, and this time you have to be very careful uh, though uh, those who have got uh, one or two mistakes uh, i think you must be very careful about that you uh, probably you have made silly mistakes and be careful about those mistakes so that uh, this time you must not make that okay so uh, okay your question is there and again you have to write down the answer so everyone is ready with your pen and paper so start writing the answer there okay so write down the answer number 1 now i want to see write down the answer number 1 Thank you. Write down the answer number one. Okay, Sir Hanley, can you write down the answer? Uh, yes, absolutely. Your answer is correct. Our parents ought to be respected by us. That's a good thing because we uh, came to know that ought to is a modal auxiliary verb, and after modal auxiliary verb, we have to use be and the past participle form of the verb. That's why uh, your answer is correct. Yeah, that means. Uh, in our parents is the object in this sentence and ought to is the auxiliary verb and uh, respect is the verb so uh, your answer is correct our parents ought to be respected by us that's good likh felo cho okay time tar no problem your answer was also correct i have seen it okay so uh, okay that's wonderful that's good 
that's very good that your answer was correct okay so uh, the first answer i want to see everyone write down the first answer write down the answer number one yes our parents are can hollow uh raki brinath i'm sorry baba or two is a model auxiliary verb so i can tomar model is the auxiliary verb so you need not bring uh, one more auxiliary verb m is r before that just simply write down tumar sob uttor thik ache shudhu r ta kete dao rakhi brinath just cross your r tahole hoye jabe right answer so our parents ought to be respected by us okay your answer is correct those who have written down our parents ought to be respected by us your answer is correct so then you write down you write down the question number answer number two i helped my mother clean the room and here one thing that you have to be careful about that this is a group the, 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 the example that comes from bare infinitive right so here you see clean is a bare infinitive clean is a bare infinitive so <coughs> your answer should be correct about that yes my mother was helped to clean <coughs> the room uh, by me my mother was helped to clean the room by me. It is That's wonderful, Ishik. Your answer is correct. Yes, Rakibrin, at this time your answer is correct. Okay. My mother was helped by me to clean the room. This is also correct answer. You can write down both. Uh, my mother was helped to clean the room or my mother was helped by me to clean the room. Both answer is correct. Uh, yeah, you can write down uh, by me uh, anywhere. Okay. My mother was helped by me to clean the room. That's wonderful answer is mom. Your answer is correct. Write down the answer number three. Everyone write down the answer number three. My mother was helped to clean the room by me. That's good. Uh, we are satisfied by his behavior. Sirhan Lihacho. Akiva Adil Lihacho. You are satisfied with his behavior. So, uh, his behavior satisfied us. His behavior satisfied us. Sirhan, uh, tumi R keno likhle? Why have you written down R? Because uh, look at this sentence. The sentence is in the past indefinite tense. So his behavior satisfied us. Satisfied is the past indefinite tense. So just to make it passive, we have to use the auxiliary verb was or were. That's why here your object is us. That will uh, be we. And uh, your auxiliary verb will be where. So we were satisfied. And one thing that you have to be careful about that because I have uh, given you a chart of using uh, other prepositions like with except by. So, and I have written there that satisfied. After satisfied, you will use always with. That's why your answer should be we were satisfied with his behavior. So with, your answer is correct. Absolutely correct. Bonni, I'm sorry, ma. Your we were satisfied with her, eh? not uh, not uh, by. Okay, so you have to memorize the chart there, uh, there where we have used so many preposition except by. So you have to memorize those chart. Okay. Uh, she was slapped by yes. Uh, next number who say five. You just write down. Sonia, are you writing answer number five or three? Uh, okay, it was a mistake, Siran. Thank you, Baba. You just correct it. Okay, so he slapped himself in uh, answer number five. You see, I slapped himself. This is a reflexive pronoun, and there he uh, will uh, remain unchanged uh, in the place. Uh, at first place, it, uh, you will use he, and after he, then you need to use auxiliary verb, and auxiliary verb will be was or were because the verb is in the past tense. Okay. That's why uh, he was and slept by himself. Right. Excellent. All of your answers are correct. Okay. And, oh, oh sorry. I have forgotten to tell about question number four. I uh, bought the poor boy a nice dress. A nice dress was bought for the poor boy by me. That was absolutely right. Ruba at that's that's wonderful that's really great that all of your answers are correct so i think the exam was uh, not too tough it was so easy in it huh? 
আমার মনে হচ্ছে পোষণটা একটু সহজ হয়ে গেছে সো নেক্সট টাইম আই উইল বি ভেরি কেয়ারফুল অ্যাবাউট দ্যাট জাস্ট টু সেট এ টাফ কোয়েশ্চেন ফর ইউ হ্যাঁ ওকে নো প্রবলেম দ্যাটস গুড ইউ আর ডুইং অল অফ দিস দি কারেক্ট অ্যানসার দ্যাট मींस আই এম রিয়েলি ভেরি প্লিজড দ্যাটস টু সি অল অফ ইওর কারেক্ট অ্যানসার দ্যাট मींस ইউ অল আর কারেক্ট ইউ অল আর অল আর রাইটিং দ্য কারেক্ট অ্যানসার দ্যাটস এ গুড থিং ওকে হানি টেস্টেড সুইট ইউ জাস্ট রাইট ডাউন আকি বাই দিস ইউ হ্যাভ রিটেন এন্ড নাও অ্যানসার নাম্বার 6 হানি টেস্টেড সুইট and you see your answer is correct honey was tasted sweet or uh, can you just write down it, it in the complex sentence what will be the answer if you write down in it, it in complex complex sentence honey ishik likhe dicho honey is sweet when it is tasted ek minute baba ishik tumi ektu bhul korle na dekho to so honey tasted sweet the verb is in the past tense the verb is in the past tense okay so the verb is in the past tense so you should not write is so you have to write was and it was sweet when it was tasted okay uh, sonia parvin i'm sorry honey is sweet when it was tasted no 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 honey was sweet when it was tasted it will be in the past tense okay it will be in the all right it will be in the past tense yes abdul show me click at honey is sweet when it was tasted excellent but be careful also about the spelling of tested t a s t e d not t e s we are going uh, to solve uh, any cos passive then you have to be very careful about the tense because past tense you have to be very careful because if you write it in the complex sentence then you have to bring the auxiliary verb according to tense and if your tense is in the past tense then you have to write was or were and if it is the present tense then you have to bring is am is are okay so be careful about the uh, about about your about your tense because you know tense or verb is the most important uh, part of speech and without using correct verb we cannot make a right sentence that's why you have to give a full concentration on your writing the correct answer of verb regarding your sentence must uh, start must be started with let amader let diye shuru hobe If there is an object, let দিয়ে শুরু হবে আর যদি অবজেক্ট না থাকে তখন ইউ আর রিকোয়েস্টেড টু আমি দুইটা নিয়ম বলেছিলাম আই টোল্ড ইউ টু রুলস টু রুলস অফ ইম্পারেটিভ সেন্টেন্স দ্য ওয়ান দ্য দ্য ভার্ভ দ্যাট উইল স্টার্ট উইথ দ্য সেন্টেন্স দ্যাট ইউজুয়ালি স্টার্টস উইথ দ্য ভার্ভ অর লেট ইজ কল্ড দ্য ইম্পারেটিভ সেন্টেন্স অ্যান্ড ইম্পারেটিভ সেন্টেন্স অ্যান্ড ইফ ইউ আর ইম্পারেটিভ সেন্টেন্স স্টার্টস উইথ দ্য ভার্ভ and if you see there is an object so you have to use let to make it passive let object be among b3 বসাতে হবে but if your uh, uh, imperative sentence is like that it starts with please or kindly okay then you have to uh, use you are requested to you are uh, requested to to make it passive uh, for example please uh, go home so in this sentence you see uh, there is no object so uh, please walk slowly so in this sentence you see there is no object that's why you have to write down you are requested to walk slowly okay uh, so in that case you have to write down you are requested to if there is no object but if there is an object then you have to start your uh, passive by using let you have let uh, so here let jodi thake tahole to obosshoi let diye korte hobe so in that case let roche so let uh, and object ki ei sentence er modhe our house let our house let our house be kept clean by us let our house be kept clean by us is from your spelling of by is incorrect okay and then uh, you have uh, you must get your answer then on the screen so you will see uh, you will see how many you have made correct and actually you will write down the uh, write down your number okay and your answer is there let our house be kept clean by us that's siran your answer is correct uh, your your answer is correct that's good great congratulations so you see all the answers are there uh, so now you will match your answers with this with this and if you uh, and count them how many you have made correct okay and how many you have made wrong so you just let me know you have given a test online and uh, you were the examiner and as well as you are the examiner so how did you enjoy the class i don't know how did you enjoy the test please let me write it write it down in the comment box so that i can see did you really enjoy it or not 
uh, okay if you uh, really enjoyed it then i would be so happy with you and i'm really so happy actually that you are participating in the class uh, so well and uh, every day uh, so it was very uh, good and good sign indeed and uh, it's a good matter of indeed uh, really happiness to me I'll stay at home and remain safe by the grace of almighty allah and uh, best of luck best wishes for